that only 38% of people in the U.S. are eligible to donate blood, and less than 10% actually do it? Did you know that one out of every seven people entering the hospital needs blood? The blood drive is coming February 22nd, and you couldn't save a life. You must be 16 or older to donate, and if you're under 18, you'll need to pick up a parent during lunchtime in the health office. Our school has accepted the challenge of helping to find a cure for blood cancer. Pennies for Patients campaign will begin February 4th through the 22nd. It will be ran through your second period class and there will be a designated collection box located in your second period for you to drop in your spare change and your dollars. On February 22nd, the second period class that has collected the most money will have lunch brought in for their entire class from Olive Garden. Now you love their breadsticks. It's a life skills. Thinking about going to prom but don't have anything to wear, the VDOT Dev Oral Foundation has gifted over 600 prom dresses to give away to low-income high school students. The dress giveaway will be happening on Saturday, February 9, 2019 from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. at the U-Haul Metamere Building located at 3979 North Freeway Boulevard, Sacramento, California. Juniors and seniors, prom is coming up and the theme is The Great Gatsby. It will take place at the Grand Island Mansion on Saturday, April 6. The last day for the cheapest prices are February 1st. Also, if you made a $50 deposit, don't forget to pay it off by February 1st. From February 4th to March 1st, prices are $100 with ASB and $125 regular. From March 4th to March 29th, prices are $110 with ASB and $135 regular. From April 1st to April 5th, prices are $125 with ASB and $150 regular. Guest passes are available at the bookkeeper and are due by the end of March. Guests pay the regular rate. Food, photo booth, and transportation are included in the ticket. If you are, you are not allowed to drive to the mansion yourself, and instead we will meet here at the school. If you have any questions, please talk to Ms. Holcomb in C104 or Ms. West in B107. Don't, Don't wait until, until the last, last minute to buy your tickets. tickets. What's, What's up, Nighthawks? Nighthawks? Are you guys excited about the rally? Because we are. If you like the last performance, then I bet you're going to love this one. We're not only performing once, but we're performing twice. We've been practicing hard and going strong. So come cheer us on at the rally this Thursday. Go Nighthawks! Cool! February is the season of... Love. If you don't have Valentine, it's okay, because we got you. So come out and get your $5, $8, and $10 baskets for yourself or a loved one. Love baskets include stuffed animal, love pillow, airheads, blow pops, box of chocolate, sour patch, balloon, short poem, and heart sugar candy. So, so come, come and get it. Order your basket at lunch. Come support. Prancy Nighthawk! Hey Nighthawks, so just to let you guys know, we have a behind the badge program. Hopefully you guys seen all the flyers around campus. Um, it's just a um, one hour after school, first Thursday of every month. So it's this Thursday, February 7th. Um, we're gonna have two SWAT guys come out and you guys can talk to them, hang out with them. And then the next few meetings, if you guys show up to the first one, we got some surprises in for you guys. And the last one should be a field trip somewhere. So stay tuned to figure out where that's at. Our Lady Nighthawks women basketball team had a great game on Friday. They bounced back with a solid win against Florin High School from 62 to 54. Junior guard Erica Mitchell had an amazing game, tossing in a career-high 34 points. Senior guard Akia Powell had another solid game, recording her sixth double-double of the season with 11 points and 14 rebounds. Junior point guard Aaliyah Holston also had 11 points, hitting 9 of 11 from the stripe. Senior guard Matea Rushing, freshman guard Asia Rodriguez, and junior post Leticia Tapia each had solid games on the defensive end of the floor while contributing two points each. Our Lady Nighthawks will host Cordova High School on Wednesday evening. This is our annual senior night where we will recognize our outgoing senior leaders, Akia Powell, Matea Rushing, and Ashane Domino. Tip-off for the varsity contest is 7 p.m. Boy soccer is having a phenomenal season. Last week they took on third place Valley High at Natomas. It was a 0-0 tie with 10 minutes left when Cristo Cervantes, with an assist from Jose Chacon, scored his 100th goal in his high school career and continued Natomas' dominance in the GSL. Now, last Friday, the boys traveled to Florin High and they pulled out a 4-2 win. Natomas has improved to 8-0 in league and they have two more games to complete the perfect season. Natomas is ranked number 22 in the section and they are gaining steam as playoffs approach. Last Friday, our Lady Nighthawks soccer team took on Florin, and it was a pouring rain event, so we have no photos or video to show you. The cameras aren't waterproof, but they won 12-0. Natomas was led by Nicole Hernandez, Veronica Nava, Brianna Prado, and numerous others in this win. Let's see if the Nighthawks can keep the W's going this week against Cordova and Johnson. And in wrestling news, uh, last week you probably heard that the girls had six wrestlers in the final, and all six were champions. Congratulations again. Then... 
later on in the week. The boys had 12 wrestlers compete, six of them made, to the, made it to the finals, and three of them are champions. Congratulations to Vincent Vu, Brent Opp, and Hilario Ruiz. They took down their opponents and they stand atop their respected weight class. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 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 I bet no money. <laughs>